So you want to be an expert using the Arxio Microsoft team for the project management. I'm going to show you how to get started totally for free today inside TechPress. First of all, what you need to do is to set up your team's empty channel. So you can start by creating a team for your product and channels for a specific topic of workspace with the Arxio project. So this helps you organize communication and collaboration. You can go directly into Microsoft.com, go into Teams and go into Download. If you have a Windows um, computer, you can find that the Microsoft team by default has been already been set it up automatically so you can just go directly inside your window section go into the teams and here automatically is going to be opened it for yourself so what you wanted to do is to sign in with your Microsoft account and you're gonna be now signed in now what you wanted to do is to customize the tab to end the application to send it in so I'm gonna go here and see okay your outlook your Skype all the information to be provided in here and you can see that I have all the actual information about my clients about the meetings about my chatting the people and all of that now here what you want to do is to collaborate on documents. Now I'm going to make this a little bit much more big enough so you can see how we can get started with the actual meet. First of all, let's talk about the actual mini section into the upper side. The mini section into the upper side is how you're going to be seeing here all the recommendations if you want to make like a quick meeting, a quick chat or locate your actual content inside the mini section. You can move this into one place or another one and you close this and now let's move it on into the actual activity. Activity is going to be showing you mid now, later, if you have any calling right now, you have to schedule a meeting for later. All the activity, everything that you've done here into the Microsoft Teams is going to be appearing automatically here. Now moving on into the actual community. Now community is going to be helping you to connect one place to make enough money you can check out to plan events, get things done easily and faster. You can join or create your own community today. So if I go for create a community, let's say for example, you're going to get starting with a text stress. And go for a description. This is just an example. Of course, if you wanted to add an image for your community, you can do it. Let's say, for example, our logo of our website and go for create. And automatically, your community is now being created and everybody here can enter directly into your community. You can type posts, you can enter photos, you can check out your events, you can create more stuff and, of course, enable email notifications. Now, moving on into the actual chat. The chat is going to be helping you to connect with all the users that you have added or contact them through the actual email. You can start a new chat, start a meeting or invite friends and the family directly into the Teams. If I go into new chat, you can go for LinkedIn and Android uh, phone to link your phone and send and receive SMS messages to your actual team. Sometimes it's much more faster to do this that way because you don't have to look out for the context from your phone and into the computer since that all the linked Android phones could be added automatically here. The calendar is going to encourage you to open communication, engagement among the team leaders using the features. You can use the ID, you can use the meetings, you can check out uh, more stuff automatically here. I'm going to go into the three dots and let's say for example that I'm going to get starting with my first meeting. You can enter the name, the email, the phone number when it comes here, what is the actual real time. If this is all the day, there's no repeated, the location and all the things to be done here inside the actual meeting. I'm going to go into save and my meeting automatically is going to be saved. Now the best thing here is that when I created an actual team, I created a meeting uh, to be working on later, all this element is going to be added of course send it directly into the calendar of my Microsoft and if you have an actual Android this element is going to be appearing into your phone as well which I think is going to be really great you can open the meeting chat and you can see that everybody who is inside this actual meeting is now into the conversation I'm going to call hello everybody directly here into the chat I have now more elements I can add polls I can add questions I can add so much more elements directly inside the actual Microsoft team and check out how of the actual cards uh, work so all of this thing that I just show you is totally for free if you have your Microsoft account, if you have an Android account, I believe that stuff like this can be done easily, faster, and you don't have to do like a lot of those elements. Of course, you can update uh, your uh, plan. There's a lot of elements that comes with the new upgraded of the actual Microsoft Teams. So for example, there's the 365s, there's the family uh, versions, uh, but that's totally up to you. You want to focus into, let's say, more than just uh, working into a PC, you can work into a Mac, you can have one terabyte of cloud storage, 
So hopefully you guys, this was a comprehensive guide of how you can get started with the actual uh, chatting or absolutely everything here into Microsoft Team. If you want guys to figure out how you can use this into an Android, you can let us know down below in the comments below too. So hopefully this was very useful information for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel guys, hit that notification bell, and well, hopefully we can all see you to brand new video of TaxPress.